when I travel the country, we try to always just find nonprofit groups and bring them to our shows that already know the issues in their area and expose the crowd to these people as they come in. We, we have these areas uh, that they can learn about the nonprofits in their, their local area. And so Farm Aid to me is this really cool national uh, gathering that happens and every year it changes locations and you know draws attention to the local issues in those locations. And so, uh, yeah, to get invited here is sort of uh, just a just an honor, like I was saying, to get to be part of this thing. Yeah, really cool. And it, it's been really interesting to see the extent to which the issues here are coming to the surface. You know, so many people talking about fracking, so yeah. many people talking about access to farmland and the need for more beginning farmers. Because you know, New York is kind of a, a, a heartland for the young farmer movement right now. So many people finding land in the Hudson Valley and starting to farm. It's pretty cool. Yeah, and where, where are you located? Where do you live? I live in the East Village. I live uh, right in Manhattan. Yeah. And, uh, you know, my work through Food Corps is about connecting people to healthy food, connecting kids to healthy food in school. And uh, I love doing that. We work in, you know, 15 states all over the country, and now we just placed our first group of eight people in Hawaii. Yeah, for the sake of the interview, I'm acting like I, I don't know what you do, just so you can explain <laughs> it. But no, it's been great. We're slowly starting to work together, which is really cool. Really? Um, we do similar work, and so it's been great. A lot of what's broken in America's relationship to food right now, I told the story of an acre of Iowa corn and its journey mm -hmm. into high fructose corn syrup and corn-fed confinement raised meat. Right. And uh, then in traveling with that film, um, we met this amazing network of young people around the country. You know, we go to college campuses and find that everywhere we went, people were starting a campus garden, they were advocating to get local food in the dining halls, and uh, Food Corps, the organization that I run now, really grew out of that opportunity to tap into the momentum and the interest young people have for mm -hmm. food and agriculture, and, you know, harness their energy to, to really make a difference with the stuff by teaching kids about healthy food.